Okay, hey you guys, it's your girl T, also known as Big Beautiful Loving It on YouTube. And um, I'm here today to talk about something that happened to me today that irritated me that I need to express because obviously it's not common sense to some people and I don't understand it, but what the hell. Um, okay, so I'm at the grocery store trying to buy a set for dinner, um, just walking around minding my business doing what I do, trying to get in and out because I'm tired. It's been a long day. So, as I am looking for the cheese I want to go with my tacos, all of a sudden I feel somebody, like, with their hand in my hand, they're like, oh my God, it's so soft. Are, are, are you fucking serious? Really? We're, we're putting... We're putting our hands in people's hair that we don't even know. Because, like, I turn and I'm like, who the fuck? Excuse me? And they're like, oh, no, I'm sorry. I was just admiring your hair. It's so beautiful. and it's so. Do you normally just walk up and touch people you don't know? And she's looking like, oh, I'm so sorry. I just, it just looked so. Bitch. And I don't usually call people bitches. And I didn't call her one. I wanted to. Everything in me was upset. Because I'm like, I felt violated. Who just touches people? Who does that? Period. I don't care if my hair was made out of glass and crystals or something and it was magical. You don't just touch it. It's mine. It's my glass and crystals and magic. Don't touch. Like, if you wouldn't walk up and just touch my face. You shouldn't touch my hair. It's just as much a part of my body as my face or my arm or just anything. You just don't touch people that you don't know. It's just common sense. And especially with, not without asking. Now, I'm going to be honest. Had she asked me, I probably still would have said no. Because, like, what the fuck? I don't know where your hands have been. I don't know you, lady. Like, ugh. Ugh. Just no. I'm so... I don't even know what to say to that because it's just, like common sense don't just touch people you don't know and i'm like i i feel you lady on the whole you know you're trying to embrace too and be like that's so beautiful what you're doing with your hair like thanks but you could say that without touching that's all that's that's the thing i mean hey i appreciate the compliment but the whole i'm gonna just put my hand all up in your situation not cool not cool it wouldn't be cool if I it wouldn't be cool if I had a relaxer. It wouldn't be cool if I was bald headed. Wouldn't be cool if my hair was going down to my ass. It just would never be cool. You don't just come and touch people that you don't know. Like, is this not common sense? Am I tripping? Just, is this not just something that everyone knows? I'm so confused. I was so confused and she was apologetic and I was like, I mean, it's okay. It's not what you did wasn't, but it's okay. <laughs> And I'm, you guys have to know, I am not a confrontational person, but that blew my mind. Never in my life has anyone ever just rolled up on me and just, that I didn't know, just put their hand all up, just like, in it. Like, she was trying to get a, a good feel for what, and I just, I couldn't even, what do you even say? You don't touch people's hair and I've heard other people talk about it I just ne like it blew my mind when I would hear people say so someone just walked up to them and touched their hair I was like really people do that and then it happened to me and I'm like wow people do that dumb shit that's ridiculous it just is it's not that I'm trying to say my hair is just so much more precious than anybody else's hair no I don't think anybody needs to just have people walking up touching them in their head or anywhere else on their body Personal space and all of that needs to be respected on every person. Now, if you're someone who's cool with somebody just touching your hair, that's great for you. But uh, me, myself, personally, <laughs> no. No. I have to know you for you to even feel comfortable enough to just touch me, let alone be touching all on my, um, on my hair. Or just, uh, no. Just no. Just no. Just say no. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Any other people ever experienced something like that, go ahead and share your experiences with me. Let I mean, I don't care if y'all say I'm tripping. Really, to be honest. I don't feel like I tripped. I feel like that was just weird. Who does that? 
So and now I gotta make the stank face. Every time I think about it, it just is like what? What? Who What's wrong with you, lady? Like you've never seen an afro before? Never. Never. No. And if she hasn't, then that's a damn shame. And if every time she does see one, she touches them. And so, like, now she's confused about the fact that I'm the first person to say you shouldn't just touch people's hair. Like, I, I don't know. I felt kind of bad for the lady because she was so apologetic afterwards. She's like, I'm so sorry. I just, I couldn't help myself. And I was like, okay. Because it was the most awkward shit. I don't know what she expected me to do. Just turn around and be like, thank you. Would you like to massage my scalp next? Go ahead. Why not? It's fun. Good times. What? No. Just no. I don't know you. No offense. I mean, I'm nice to people, but just, you know, personal space. Anywho, that's all. I wanted to share with you guys my random experience for the day. It finally happened to me. Somebody got a little bit reckless, put the hands all up in inside of the lady here. I need to find a name for her. Let me go figure out a name. Mm -hmm. Anywho, <laughs> um, I hope you guys had a great day. I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces. Yes, vocals. I got <laughs> Bye.